The thing that makes narcissistic parents so pathetic is the fact that they want to see their children unhealthy, sad, down, and depressed, struggling, broke, no purpose, no nothing at all. Why bring a child into this world that you don't want to see healthy, that you don't want to see succeed, that you don't want to see thriving? They want to see their children unhealthy. They want to see their children having poor and bad habits, having sorts of addictions, just so they can gloat about those addictions to their child's face and talk about this with other people and say, my child is dealing with this, my child is dealing with that, all because they want sympathy, because they want people to feel bad for them, because they want the attention that comes with the dramatics of your life. But they don't ever talk about what they're doing to help their child get out of that situation. They can talk so much about the child situ about the child situation, but talk very little or none at all about what they're going to do to help their child get out of that situation. They don't want to see their children healthy. They can see their child being sick. They won't do anything to help them. They won't go take them up to the doctor or up to urgent care. They'll just let their child sit there and suffer. They can see that their child is dealing with mental type of turmoil and illness and instead of them easing back they're going to just keep harping and harboring all on their child just keep beating them down to make them feel worse when they see that their child is struggling with depression and they're feeling down these are the parents that will kick their child while they're down will throw dirt on their child will just make things worse for the child because they want to see them just give up their child can go through a traumatic situation and they come back to their parents because they need that, that love, that support. They just ignore their child and give their child their ass to kiss. They want to see their children struggling and broke. They don't want to see them working. They don't want to see them having their own money because when the child actually has a job, actually has money, they got their hand out. You know, it's almost like, give me some of that money. Come pay this. Pay this bill. Come do this for me. You can pay for this for me. That's our money because they want they feel entitled to what the child has it's like it, they want the child to work so that they can have some extra money coming in for themselves when they know that they don't necessarily need it they're just wanting it that's just greed it's greedy it's gluttony they always got their hand out asking for something and then if the child is not working they're rubbing it in their child's face you're not working right now you need to find something better to do with your time and then when the child goes out to try to find something to do better with their time why are you spending so much time outside you need to come stay in the house more like make up your mind what do you want it's a walking contradiction as they go parent their child so what do you do fuck them take your power back do what you gotta do to earn your income and make your money do what you have to do to remain healthy if you gotta have your medicine take your medicine what are they gonna do they ain't gonna do shit whatever it is that she needs to do to stay healthy do that to stay healthy thrive in their face shine your light in their face stand into your truth speak your truth walk your truth in their face outshine them outgrow them do everything better than them. Be better than them. Let them wallow in their self-pity. Let them relish in their insecurities. Let them relish in all of their wounds that they want to try to project onto you. If they want to be unhealthy, let them be unhealthy. If they want to be bitter and miserable, let them be bitter and miserable, but let them do that by themselves. Don't you be a part of it. You do what you need to do to fulfill yourself and to make yourself happy and to live a fulfilling life that is happy and healthy and joyful. Don't abide by their control. Fuck them in their control. Because basically their whole entire parenting that they had towards you is fuck you, so fuck them. Fuck them back. Not in that way, but you know, if they're telling you fuck you, tell them fuck you too. Energetically. <laughs>